get back to the levels of learning. And we did this a while back and I thought maybe we could visit it at the next level up. So, um, I kind of created these different things. Dressage is complex and it is easy to get stuck doing the same thing over and over and not feeling like you are progressing. So how can you help yourself move forward faster? So some things that we need to be a good rider, a, a good dressage rider, but a good uh, rider in any way. Uh, so a good position, including to develop your seat, a level of fitness, understanding the aids, understanding of the way that the horse moves naturally, understanding of the movements, how to ask and what they are. I think that we need a little bit of feel, a feeling of what's going on underneath us, an understanding of the horse. You have its present training level and how it accepts the aids. So I think this is really important that we develop, and that takes a little while, a clear understanding of the horse that we are riding. If you don't ride the same horse every day, then you get a little bit better at um, analyzing what you know, different horses, so you take lessons on different horses all the time, then you would work on, you know, how quickly can I kind of analyze or ask questions, right, from the trainer. Um, and if we ride a horse every day, we need to know where that horse is starting so that we can work together with it appropriately. And then um, the last one, is someone on the ground that you trust. So sometimes we think we're doing things uh, that we're not. Sometimes things aren't as bad as we think they are. So having somebody on the ground just to help you a little bit with the visual is really great. So I, I, I no matter what, if you have a daily trainer or not, uh, I think that being able to ask somebody what's going on can be very useful. All of these things are necessary, these things, these eight points, but it's not gonna be linear. So we want one of the things that I think can be helpful and that can be something you can use your journal for is to rate each um, category, rate ourselves in each category our strengths and weaknesses, depending on the present horse and what is the most important thing for us to start working on. 